Y'all, good morning, good morning. Listen, man, I appreciate the love. Y'all going crazy on YouTube right now, man. Appreciate it. Appreciate you liking, appreciate you sharing, appreciate you spreading the word, spreading my knowledge of trucking. I appreciate it, man. I'm letting y'all know right now that that is not taking advantage, man. But that being said, as y'all can see, man, we over here getting loaded, right? Bro, I'm sick and tired of these flies, man. Flies being here, you can't get them out. Flies is a smart bug, bro. You wind down your window, that bitch will fly the other way. You understand what I'm saying? But no, nah, but oh, uh, we're over here getting loaded, right? I just want to show y'all what I deal with on a daily basis in the oil field. Right now, I'm, like I said, right now I'm getting loaded. I'm finna go drop off, which is 64 miles, so possibly what 59 miles, 59 minutes if there's no traffic. So it's not too bad at all. I'm flip, finna flip the camera and show y'all the setup where, where I get loaded at. So this is the facility that I get loaded at, as y'all can see. 24 hours a day, it's always running. Y'all catching, I'm getting loaded right now. But now this reason why I'm making this video, because lately I've been wanting to make this video and show y'all what I go through on a daily basis, but I'm always ripping and running. Only have to do two loads today. So I got time to show y'all and vlog and show y'all what I go through. Last night I went to sleep around about 12 o'clock and uh, I got a pretty good sleep, but I will say this, DOT rules apply out here, but they, they're, they're different from over the road. You run out, you get a 24 hour reset instead of a 34. Also the time you get to run, like you get to run out here because you might get to a well and the well might be down for a while, right? So that time you off duty, so it's basically like that's your time to sleep. So once that well go again, you, you going again. Then at some point in time, you know, you can go ahead and go to sleep at some point in time. If you're tired, if not, keep running and making your money. So, but no, nah, man, I would say this, Texas is fun, man. I, I love being out here, I love the atmosphere people out here look out for each other like this is real trucking man this is real trucking if you break down on the side of the road and one of your company people pass by you they're gonna stop and try to help you if you ain't got nothing to eat inside your truck and they got something to eat and you cool with them they're gonna call you hey i'm cooking over here yeah yeah, yeah. come over here and do this plus it's a culture change i'm up here man and i'm not i'm not by nothing but spanish people so I'm learning, teaching myself Spanish as I go. For example, Cerrado. Is that, did I say right? Cerrado mean clothes. Uh, rojo, red. Verde mean green. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm teaching myself this as I go. So it's it's a plus. I'm not doing that many miles. I probably do a load is 120 miles all together. 128 miles all together. So you think about it. That's 64 miles here, 64 miles back. So you do two, say you do three loads a day. That's one, 120, yeah, one, you're going to do 120 so it's even. 120 times three. So how many miles I make? Plus, I'm not burning that much fuel, right? On top of that, the money that I'm getting paid for a load, I just, I just say this, I just say this. Do $500 divided by 60, you tell me what it is. That's what I'm getting paid for a mile. Some might say it's trash, some might say it's good, but for me it's good. I run the same lanes every day. Look at that, and, and. Write down my information now. 61700. Y'all can see, I wrote my information down. You part at 820. Right, hold on, I'll be back with y'all. I gotta take a picture real quick. And then once I take that picture, I'm gonna show y'all me closing the door and we're gonna hit on this road, man. We got the green light, right? 
But no, nah, some might say that's trash, some say very good. I like it, I run the same lane every day, so I can't complain. Finna go up here and get this ticket. Once I get this ticket, I sign over everything, put all my numbers and everything, make sure that they add up, close the door on this hatch, and ride to the blue moon, come on. Sorry about that, I had to type my information. But as you see right now, pull one ticket, wait for the next one. That's two tickets. Yo, just like that, we done. Make sure my letter locked in. Yo, just like that, we headed over here to this place, right? Like I said, it's only 64 miles. I'm gonna get back with her when I get there. Ooh, I got excited messing with y'all, man. But now it's cold as hell, like that's why my breath's short. But I'm like I said, I'm gonna get over here, drop this off. But I'm not gonna vlog and drive because a lot of people been in the comment section trying to come at me. I'm gonna reply to comments because I feel like I need to interact with y'all more. But at the same time, I hope y'all understand. I look at them, I like them, I heart them. Um, but I don't have the time really to reply. I'm not using that as no excuse, but today I have time. As y'all can see, if the well keep running like this today, it's gonna be an early day. And I just go ahead and reply in depth, giving y'all a reaction so y'all can see how I'm coming. Also, see what kind of tone that I'm bringing to it because a lot of people read messages and don't understand how you feel about it. Like the negative comments. You might think I might be mad and I'd be like, oh, I appreciate it. Bro, I'm not mad, bro. I don't know you. I appreciate the love. I appreciate you taking time in your day to reply to me, but I really don't know you. But that being said, it is what it is. You understand what I'm saying? Try to put these overalls on. But that's what the video is about today. Show y'all what I go through. Show y'all the pickup. Show you the drop off. Respond. And that's how we run it, man. Listen, y'all stay tuned for this. This finna be funny. Y'all stay tuned for this, man. Love y'all. But now, as y'all can see, man, I just made it to the well. But I'm telling y'all, look like a good day, bro. Ain't a lot of trucks here. Normally, the trucks be all the way back right here. So, I might do a photo today. I don't know. I don't know. I'm excited, man. I'm excited. Bro, God damn, why is it so loud, bro? Look at it. It rained the other night, or the last two nights, bro. And it messed the road up. It used to be smoother than this. Y'all, this is the first day that ran like this, like I was seeing. Look at this, man. I'm, I just got here, and I'm the first truck after this one. When I tell you, bro, it's exciting. I might do four today, right? But I just want to show y'all, man. You see that? Those three boxes right there is where the sand go down the chute, right? And they now to put water in to keep it from getting compact. 
all those boxes right there is full but the track to do the unloading then you go back there you go to the back of the office sign the paperwork and you're gone but look at this man all day all night that's all they do but now I tap it make sure it's empty lock your pin all right Boom, you ready to go. Y'all, so listen, I just made it to the stop, right? I'm gonna end the video with this, but I really want to do these comments so y'all can see my reaction. So here it go. Y'all, here we go. So now y'all can see I got it uploaded, right? I'm finna read these comments off. Let's let's get into it, bro. Uh let me see. Comments. Okay, here go a good one. Good job. Thanks for taking the time to film this. I know it was a tough job. Even tougher when you're trying to film it too. Question, was the diesel leaking from the filter drain plug only uh, when the truck was running or draining out? When was it turned off? The truck was leaking from the drain plug just because I forgot to, to turn the drain plug off. That was the hot shot video of me teaching y'all how to change your fuel. That was on me. Right, that's the only reason why I was leaking because the compression on it was blowing it out of there or out of the out of the valve, I guess you can call it. But I didn't close it, so that's on me. What is a drive-in? I guess that's the drive-in video. Listen, I got a, I'm country. I got a country accent, so if y'all don't like it, my bad, bro. That's what. Hell yeah. To the next one. Uh. Why are you self snitching on yourself that are driving illegal on your ELD? Come on, bro. I know that you want to make video, but be safe and smart about it. I'm OTR trucker as well. Listen, I never incriminated myself at all in any of my videos. If you watch my videos, I show y'all, right? I be like, but I don't say anything that I'm doing. You, you don't know that paper might not have nothing on it. I still might be running my ELD. You never know. You know what I mean? So, don't assume without knowing your assumption might be right just leave it at that who knows uh thanks for the help fella this is the first comments and i sure appreciate someone that's real god bless yeah listen man i'm gonna give y'all everything that that i can give y'all man and that's what it's about it's about helping other people get into this game because i didn't have nobody to help me i dove straight off into it and looking back at it, if I looking back at it, if I would have known what I know now, I would have went slower at, at a slower pace to get there. But I do all this to help y'all. You know what I mean? And it was another one, another one about the forklift. A guy never hauled the forklift. He wound up picking up four. He watched my video and it helped him strap down. And and that right there is a blessing because I, I'm I'm helping somebody else make money, man. Changing y'all life, bro. I'm telling y'all, man. Good job, bud. Appreciate it. I will say this. Most of the comments that I get from you guys are positive. The negative ones, I like it just as well, but I get more positive than negative. I don't know if we can get bigger. Will we get ne more negative? I don't know. But I'm, I'm ready for that. You know what I mean? I'm ready to grow the trend. I appreciate all y'all supporting it. I appreciate uh, 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 my buddy. Y'all know who he is. I'm not name dropping because I don't want, I don't want people to think that I'm trying to clout chase. If y'all came from his page, I appreciate y'all. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, this, 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 this where I went. Are you okay? Are you on dope or something? Because there's no way the sketchy stuff is no way. Are you okay? You need a goddamn a hug because those back streets are crazy. Driving by a house is insane. Nobody does that. No way. How many people did you see blow up? Are their heads in the streets? 
What the hell is wrong with you young dips? Come on, what the hell are you what the hell are you talking about? Are you just stupid? Seriously. No, come on, a waste of damn time, fool. Listen. I don't know what the hell he was typing. Right? But the gist of it, I guess that the middle in the middle of it, he was saying I was wrong for taking a back road going through houses. Listen. And this on the short. If you watch that short, it was a it was an accident. A four car accident where I guess one of the cars got smashed horrib horribly. Is that a word? Horribly. And traffic couldn't get through there. I don't know if anybody died. I don't know. Hopefully not. But everybody was going off to the side street. If you from Florida, if you from Florida, you know about side streets, back roads. They might be tight, but they big enough for trucks. And now let me say this also. How do the people that live at that house get their uh, their equipment or whatever to build that house? How, how do they get that? How do they get the products to build it? So that being said, y'all listen to me. I had to take that back road. I wasn't the only semi back there, right? I wasn't. Hold on real quick. Let me accept this call and I'm going to come right back to y'all. Y'all, this is going to be the last one. I'm going to try to end it with a positive. Like I was saying, man, all the video, all the comments has been positive, right? Sorry for the interruption. I got a phone call I needed to take. That was a business meeting. Um, hold on. Let me find a good one. Let me find a good one. You can tell this man cares about the trailer and truck. Some of the comments are weak, weak ass keyboard flexing. I'm gonna end it on that one just because I want to say this, man. Appreciate you for speaking that, right? I look at it just like this. At the end of the day, this truck and trailer, the truck that I just got out the shop, Riri's back. If you're new to the channel, are you? Uh, are you? Y'all know Riri started everything. Riri started this, started the channel. Uh, 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 got the views where it was at, uh, got this semi, you know what I mean? Got me where I'm at now. She's back. She's out of the shop. She got picked up yesterday. All she doing is waiting on me to clean up. So, you know, I'm finna go home. I'm finna go clean, get a real clean caressa. Yeah, I'm still talking with my truck. I love my truck. Um, but no, no matter what truck and trailer that I'm in or what truck and trailer that I buy for my company, I'm going to take care of it because simply out of fact, that's what makes me money. That's what make me be able to go ahead and make this content for y'all. What makes me be able to go pay the bills that I need to pay. What make me live the lifestyle that I need to live. That helped me take care of my family as well. That's the most important thing to me. So, when you, I'm glad that y'all can see that in my videos. I try not to talk about that. But I'm glad that y'all can see that, man. Bro, you take care of yourself, right? Why don't you take care of your equipment that makes you money? Your truck run off fuel, your truck run off oil, your truck, your truck run off of of maintenance. Bro, you work out every day, right? Even if you don't go to the gym, you still walk. Right? You eat every day. You put full fuel in your body. You drink water, right? You drink water. You put oil in your body. Same as a truck. Come on, man. People make it seem like it's hard to take care of your equipment. But if that equipment makes you a lot of money, I guarantee you you're going to take care of it. But I appreciate you for saying that, man. I appreciate you. I appreciate you for, for sticking up for me, too, as well. Even though you didn't even though you didn't have to. That's love. Listen, man. We're going to end the video with that. Y'all keep them ties bounces, man. I love y'all to the next video.